All right, Bob, do you want to uh, welcome everybody to this installment? Yeah, absolutely do. It's great to have Lynn Sue, right? That's right, way to pronounce it, yes. Uh, yeah. And uh, Lynn, have we met before? I don't think so. All right. First time. Very good. Well, really nice nice meeting you. Nice Done, meeting you. Uh, Lynn, Lynn Sue is a uh, cartoonist for The New Yorker. She... Uh, uh, see, I've done my research and background as an architect, and that's where it will certainly come into play for the cartoon uh, that she's done. She writes for the Weekly Humors and Space and Time magazine, which I went up and just uh, looked at, which seems uh, interesting. So tell us a little bit about your background, how you got into cartoonings, how eventually you just walked out of that architect's <laughs> office and said, I can't take this anymore. <laughs> What not happened? so dramatic, not so direct, but yeah. So I, uh, where, so I, yeah, I'm a Boston-based writer and cartoonist. I grew up in Missouri, um, and uh, always loved drawing and painting and art. Uh, and then I had to decide on a career at some point, you know, in high school. And the counselor was like, "Oh, you're good at you're good at math. You're good at art." Oh, how come they thought that? What? How come they stereotyped you as that? Oh, well, I was good at math, even though I didn't like it. Yeah. I was. that, But yeah. Um, and they said, yeah, just why don't you try architecture? Because, you know, I guess art wasn't uh, recommended. Yeah. So, <laughs> so then I did. And I kind of went into that track. And I, uh, yeah, I went to school. And then I um, worked for 20 years. Wow. Yeah. Doing a lot of uh, mostly campus buildings, university work, big projects. So you were part of a of a big firm, a company that yeah, mostly yeah. I worked for a lot of different firms, but um, probably the longest time I worked was at so, a bigger office. So what is the building that you're proudest of, Lynn? Um, I'm proud of a museum, a children's museum. That wow, I that's, great. That's, yeah, great. So so, that's, that's great. Yeah, so we can say that's cool. It's a cool building type. It's it's a great field. It's just. Uh, yeah, I, I sort of I sort of reached this level, and then I think five years ago I wanted to kind of do stuff on the side that was fun because my job wasn't as getting to be as fun as it yeah. was. So I started uh, humor writing, um, doing some uh, sketch comedy at Improv Boston, and then uh, the pandemic hit, and then the theater shut down, and so then I was kind of looking for different outlets to express kind of a creative um do some creative work and ended up uh taking some cartooning classes and drawing cartoons so i kind of started in the so pandemic what what what's your what's your your schedule uh like now in terms of cartoons i guess you submit to the new yorker to do a batch every week and yeah. send it in i try i try i don't do a full batch just because i don't have time um, so I try to at least submit maybe five a week. Um, I some see. of them are, some of them are reworked, older drawings that I want to try to save um, with the new caption, you know. Uh, well, and then I also do some writing um, on the side and things like that. Well, yeah. Well, that makes sense. I mean, I think well that. Uh, you know, when you're a cartoonist and you do the cartoons and you do uh, the batches, I mean, one of the things that the caption contest in general shows is there are many alternative ways to look at an image and we'll see what you came up with. And that often when you come back to a cartoon, uh, you see it in another way or you, or the cartoons that you've done spark, you know, or, you know, other, other ideas. Yeah. So, uh, Anyway, why don't, that's great. Great to have you here. Thanks so much for doing that lovely yeah. drawing. Thank you. And, and do you have cats? I do not. I'm a dog person. I'm allergic to cats. <laughs> oh, I see. Well, we, so I, I have uh, uh, three dogs and two cats, and one of them may come very likely visit us. <laughs> so, and Trevor, you just have dogs, right? Yeah, one dog right now, sadly. But yes, I'm a dog. I'm also allergic to cats. But uh, I wish I knew you were an architect when I saw this cartoon. Uh, but uh, I'll, 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 it, I'll segue into that now. But uh, here is Lawrence. Do you have pets? Yeah, Lawrence. Uh, I do. I'm a dog person and allergic to cats. But I have children who like cats, so I have two cats. 
the same. I think my daughter likes. All right. Well, well, well. They're, they're, uh, so here's here's Lynn's uh, caption contest. Um, it's a uh, realtor talking to a prospective buyer, you assume, for a for sale house that is a uh, that essentially is like a giant cat, uh, a cat toy, cat building uh, house. It's a cat tree, right? That's what they're called. Is that what they're called? I, I, I think so, for some for some reason. Uh, and uh, that's... Uh, uh, we'll zoom in a little bit because there were a lot of carpeting jokes, but I think just so people are aware, um, these are... Uh, these are... Uh, it's They are carpeted. Uh, oh. They are... Car there is a carpeting texture just to... Uh, and they And they're uniformly ugly. We had one. It's like they're really monstrosities in a way. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and and I think some of the jokes run around is we did have one for our cats and they rarely, rarely used it. Really. To be honest, I've only ever seen them being thrown out on the side of the street in New York. And I always find it to be <laughs> such, a, such a gross piece of garbage compared to all yeah. other garbages. Uh, yeah. But so uh, right, go into it. We actually did have a lot in common this week, as opposed to last week where we didn't even have uh, six. Um, That's great. And then, all right. So I, uh, you know, just to stick with it, we'll, we'll, uh, well, I will highlight the ones that <clears throat> we all had in common. It comes with some strings attached. It's a quiet neighborhood. You can sleep 23 hours a day. It's very pet friendly. There were a lot of variations on that. I want to just yeah. check some dupes uh, in case um, the neighborhood is very quiet, especially now that all the birds are gone. Uh, the owners are moving. I like that one. The owners are moving to the box it came in. There are also variations on that one. Yeah, a different place. Yeah. The previous owner just got too old and had to be put down. <laughs> no, too cruel. <laughs> It makes me laugh. And also, yeah. <laughs> the seller downsized to a pile of warm laundry. And I, that was a version I liked yeah, that, I, did, that I, I didn't choose yeah. because I, it was too close to. to the seller is highly unmotivated. This one I also want to check for dupes, but. Yeah, I, I, I like. I mean. Had five. That, every single person. That's a great caption. Every single yeah. person had this one. Which one? Yep. The seller is highly unmotivated. Everyone well, that's great. I, I, I mean, I think that's great from a kind of technical aesthetic point of view where the uh, uh, switch comes on the last word. It just, you know, it's a one word. Yeah. Uh, you know, Bruce R. Kaplan who used to do a lot of cartoons for the New Yorker would often, you know, that would be his specialty almost. It would be, it would be two, two women talking and they have kids around them and one of them is saying, they grow up so slow. So yeah. it's just the last word. So it's hard to yeah. do that. And I, yeah. So, no, that's a yeah, good one. And you can, if you take it to the next extent, you can just imagine a cat not giving a crap if it's sold or not. Uh, right. yeah. the, the seller knocked our offer off the table. Yeah, I, I, uh, I, I, I mean, a lot of, none of them, it was hard to, uh, uh, Lynn, often when we talk about this, we're very uh, sort of picky in a way, very probably over analytic in that, you know, rather than, yeah, it's got to sort of do it for you. But like for me, it's always like, yeah, but isn't there a little, little, a little something? No one's addressing the size, okay? And and okay, and there's a problem here. This is not it, who's in there. A huge cat, <laughs> you know, and or in the neighborhoods, you know, very quiet, you know. Well, for the neighborhood to be, you can sleep well. What about the other houses? Maybe people are noisy in those houses. So I'm always looking at like, you know, you know, slight objections, although you tend to feel like, well, did you laugh at it originally? You know, it's, you know, did it work for you immediately then, even if you have an objection, but yeah, you know, why don't you go on, Trev? The, the last one uh, that uh, they're open to all offers, low ball, high ball, darn ball. <laughs> well, I thought that was cute. I yeah, that, that, was, that was actually yeah. one of Bob's. Yep. Yeah. So, um, yeah, generally how we do this is we try to knock these down to six and then we go fight for all of ours. If there were any that we didn't, um, should we keep it that same way? Um, 
So I do, uh, I think, uh, if, if anyone has wants, how many do we have here? So we got a few, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, so we have to take out quite a few here. Um, it seems like where the seller went is one that we could consolidate into, into one. Maybe if you guys think, if you want to have one joke well, where like the owners move to a different. It, well, it's either oh. that or the laundry. Yeah. That, yeah. Well, just, I just, I, I'm just trying to think about how we start to knock these out. I think maybe just have one joke, one caption of where, what happened to the sellers really. Uh, if you want to start there or, or Joel, Bob, anyone have a suggestion? Of well, I like it. They moved to, uh, uh, I think it's sort of cute that they moved to the box that came in. In, in that, when I was, yeah, when, in, I, when in, I was in, thinking, was gone. Sorry, Bob. What's that? I was just going to say when I was kind of thinking, oh, what would I do if I was entering? I, I, prob I was kind of toying around with the idea of the box that came in type jokes. Uh, so yeah, it, it, I, it's definitely in there, isn't it? I don't like the wording of it though. The, the owners are moving to the box I came in. It feels quite plain. It feels like it needs. It, it needs to be either snappier or or something something. The seller downsized to a pile of warm laundry is a is a cuter way, a more interesting way of that. Yeah, well, I, I like that one. I had both of those in my top ten, but I like warm laundry uh, well, better than the box. I think I like warm laundry. Well, well, uh, how about they moved to the box that came in, which had warm laundry? <laughs> yeah, for <friend. laughs> uh, the the, uh, the this is actually sometimes a, a discussion. Lawrence and I have about the difference between a regular cartoon that would appear in the New Yorker versus a caption contest cartoon. Mm -hmm. And a caption cartoon appearance sometimes for a cartoon that just appeared in the New Yorker, something like the box it came in would work better because it's just a very, it's a simple sentence and it just finishes off the cartoon. When you wait for a caption contest, often you want someone to do a little something fancy you you want to enjoy that's why we say it's plain we you don't we usually don't complain for a cartoon that appears in a magazine that the language is too plain in fact we like the language to be very plain when a, when an image is very unusual that's true that that, that that's seems true. like it seems like you're competing it seems like you're actually competing with the image that for me anyway the ideal magazine cartoon is either ordinary, completely ordinary, plain image with sort of a interesting caption, you know, words, or a, a very unusual image, which are completely simple caption. Uh, but, you know, I will, I will uh, defer to so Lawrence, the eight-time winner yeah, of the, I, I find the word caption contest. But the uh, but I I would I would say it's better that's better from the magazine point of view. But I don't know. I'm 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 happy I'm happy with either one. I, I, yeah. I think one of those two should be a, a finalist. Yeah, one I, I think one of those two. I I, I think the warm laundry run -run. Is, is the consensus. One, um, if we're if we're trying to get rid of some, I I like the knock off offer off the table. It, it's it doesn't seem to work in. No, that's not that great. It doesn't work in context either. It looks like the person showing the house. It's not really not that like you know we're being too, too, too you know specific about this, but you wouldn't really well, show well, on the outside of the house and say they knocked it off the table. It's, it's a little bit well, of well, 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 well. I don't know. Also, it's just pretty much just wordplay in a way yeah. where we're imagining something. I mean, they're both sort of the same. It's cat behavior, but it's trying to do a little something extra with they knocked it off the table having two meanings as well, where the other one is they moved to the box it came in is actually there's no wordplay at all. It's just complete uh, a characteristic of cats within this framework. So I think that I think you're right. We can knock that off. Um, now, the um, if any, I, I, well, I've been killing them here. So if someone else wants to uh, fight or, or, or maybe we try to fight to, to kick one out right now. Uh, I I um I did not like the one that you guys uh, liked, which was all the different low ball, high ball, hair ball. Yeah. Um, I hate that. 
No, that's too soon to give in to him. That's too soon. He should come. It comes with strings attached is, is such a low chuckle for me. I don't think anyone will actually laugh at that cartoon, if, but I, I'm happy keeping that there. But look, I don't, I, I don't like it. It's a quiet neighborhood. You can sleep 23 hours. Yeah, I think it's because how, 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 how does that make sense? Because he, what he's got... They've moved out. The cat isn't there anymore. Who's in the other house? All right. I think that's true. We, we do try to make these make sense. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that can go. Uh, that can go. Um, all right. We need to knock off one more before we fight for our any favorite ones here. Um, could, could you go through them again? Uh, yeah, no problem. Whatever. It comes with some strings attached. Yeah. Um, it's it's very pet friendly. That's good. Now. The name, uh, that's too easy for you. There's a lot of variations of that, so I need to double check that we didn't do any. But that's, I mean, that's such a pop. pop yeah, it's a, it might be too easy for Lawrence. The neighborhood is very quiet, especially now that all the birds are gone. Is funny to me. Yeah, that's funny. I They're mean, open to weird. all offers: low ball, high ball, yarn ball, fur ball. Lawrence is gonna hates that. Hates that. Okay. Well, uh, okay. The previous owner just got too old and had to be put down. No. The that one makes me laugh. It makes me laugh. The previous <laughs> owner got too old. It makes to me to laugh. Put down. <laughs> I, I'm with Trevor on that one. I like the dark humor. I think at the uh, end of the day, if it if the cartoon makes me laugh, it's important. I think there were a lot of dark ones about. Yeah, you, all you dog, all you dog people. I know. If, if this was about dogs, yeah, I would not allow this one. Yeah. If this was about a dead dog, we would not have this one. I'm gonna the, send you. I'm gonna send you as a present the classic book One Hundred Uses for a Dead Cat. Oh, no. You might oh, like yeah. that. I remember. Yeah. The uh, the the alternative to that that I liked, I've got, I had that on my list, but the one I, I liked as well was full disclosure. There have been several hundred murders here. Yes, I, thought, I like that one too. That made it to my list. I thought that was very uh, and that's I, I, I didn't see that. the same idea. Um, so what do we? I mean, I, I'm okay with well, Lawrence is the one that he hates. I'm okay with knocking down because it doesn't really make me laugh too much. Okay, ago. is that okay with you guys? Or uh, it seems like no one wants to fight yeah. for that one. Yeah, we'll get we'll get complaints by the time. Oh, Lawrence again, knocking yeah, out my <laughs> Lawrence again, knocking out my caption. All right, so we have six. So what we do right. now basically is we uh, start with somebody here and see if. Uh, well, I if, think the seller is highly unmotivated. Is should be the winner. Palm is just skipping in. I will say it's very rare that we all, that we all have motivated. Is yeah. It's very rare that we have one that we all, I don't think we've ever had one that every single person had in their list. Mm. Wow. I'd have to look back, but yeah, I can, I think that is the case. But that, that is so clearly the best caption. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The seller is highly unmotivated. It, it's concise, uh, ends on the punchline, incorporates all the disparate elements. Uh, you sound like a guy who's written a book about this, <laughs> you know, <laughs> Really well, uh, let's, we should let's let, the whole idea is this should be tantalizing and then we eventually arrive at the end point we shouldn't just steam in with the answer <laughs> well it's it, 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 it I, I, annoying I, I mean it's different than the new yorker capturing content which i created for god's sake the last winner uh I, I don't usually pick up men this way with the ones with on the swing that was terrible you know which one i'm talking about lawrence it's the woman on a trapeze over a PC Vacar guy in a, a quicksand, you know, and she's swinging and she said, I don't usually pick up men this way. I think then, Lawrence is frozen. Anyway, I think <laughs> he's frozen. frozen. Anyway, he agrees with me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, well, well, I think uh, we'll, uh, we'll go through and see. I did. I, I put a couple of the captions on the image. Maybe we'll just quickly look at that, and then we'll go through uh, and see about any additional ones. Um, <clears throat> um, let me uh, stop sharing here. Oh, God, I put myself. Um, all right, and this is just to just to give us a just to give us a little starting spot here. Um, the seller is highly unmotivated. Yeah, we don't want to start with the eggs. So we've got to lead up to it. The neighborhood is very quiet, especially now that all the birds are gone. That one does make me laugh too. Yeah, 
was funny. Um, uh, all right. Well, we'll here's what we'll do. We'll move on to um, <clears throat> to uh, to see if anyone wants to fight for any that aren't in these six. This is a little different though, because today we seem to have had. I don't really have any. The one that I have in mind uh, is the neighborhood is very quiet now. The birds are gone. Is up there with unmotivated for me. But I have none that are that we haven't talked about that I want to fight for. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. So we'll move over. We'll go. I've got Joel, Joel wants to fight. Go ahead, Joel. I don't. No, I don't. Fighting's too strong a word. I suggest mildly suggest. I will run with mildly suggest. And the two that I thought were interesting is that you've got sort of two different takes on the same idea he's got. It's very pet friendly. Uh, and then you can, you sort of flip that and you can have, unfortunately, the least says no animals, which I quite like. If you've gone to all this trouble and you can't have pets anyway, it's quite a nice take on it. So I did like that. It's more commentary than anything I'd fight for. And I would mildly fight for full disclosure. There have been several hundred murders here. Yeah. It makes me laugh. It just does. There's no, there's no uh, analysis beyond well, that. Well, I mean, I, I... I think it's I like nice. the language of it. No, I, think I, the, I think it's nice where there's sort of a hidden narrative that you have to put together. Right. It's something completely different, you right. know, and it doesn't mention the words, you know, the also, I think there's something uh, 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 interesting about a caption from, from which it would be impossible in any way to guess what an image might be. You know what I mean? So that caption yeah. you couldn't possibly say what that image is, nor does it fit a lot of other. In fact, it's almost fun to think of all the of, of what kind of like almost a reverse caption contest. If you had full disclosures, there have been several hundred murders here. What kind of images would make that funny? Yeah. Now, yeah. and it is popular with with selling homes. Like it is a popular question of what's happened in the home previously. So it actually does make more sense than it. Oh, that happened to me once. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah there, I, a house I bought was associated with a murder. Nearly bought was associated with murder. Um, let's go, Bob. Are there any that you had that you uh, that that aren't part of our seven now? Because I do. I added. Well, tools. And, and I was thinking a number of people have wanted me to mur murder me in my own house. <laughs> <laughs> People I've lived with, but I, uh, no, I don't. I don't. I, 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 I like the unmotivated thing. It's the winner. That's all I was saying. Yeah. Lawrence, any, any, five places to fill. Any, uh, any ones you want to highlight that we uh, that no one else thought? No one yeah, had um, I, I'm not going to be as polite as Joel. Um, <laughs> uh, I get <laughs> nobody wanted to go with uh, the sex joke. Um, the cat house is maybe too obvious. What's but that? I, I did, and there were a lot of cat house jokes. No, but I, no. the best of them was it's not, it's not that kind of cat house. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't like that. All right, and then uh, I, 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 I thought the sleaziest one that I what was the one I liked where, but it, but it ended so sleazy that I thought it was it was uh, uh, they'll feign interest, walk away, and then rub up against you. <laughs> I think there was something about the last part about that, which I felt was, oh, well, that's a little icky. <laughs> uh, I also um, had the owner will sleep on your offer, but that's too close to highly unmotivated. Yeah. Um, I had, would you prefer just a patch of sunlight on a rug? Uh, but that is too close to warm laundry in the box it came in. Um, the current owners just don't find it interesting anymore. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, I, I those, those are all. Right. But I, 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 yeah, yeah. I, and I've had several buyers interested briefly. Uh, it's also too close to yeah, so all, all the. Well, it's interesting. The buyers yeah. would be interested in it. See, that's interesting because that be, that becomes that switches it where the buyers right. are cats. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right. Exactly. Uh, uh, you know, rather than the and seller. Then the last one I, I liked, uh, probably just because it was so short, was uh, "No dogs allowed." Yeah. 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 Um, yeah, I don't think anyone's putting any of those back in this, the, the main group, right? <laughs> <laughs> there was a bunch of excitement. <laughs> Lynn, are, do you, are there, did you have any here that were a favorite that no one else uh, said a seconded? Um, I, I don't know. I guess my favorites were the, yeah, the seller is highly unmotivated and the neighborhood is very quiet, especially now that the, all the birds are gone. Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay, so, so then, we'll, then we will we'll acknowledge. So now we're so, actually back to seven because I did add Joel's because Joel's did seem to make everyone laugh. Uh, wait, so what? Uh, what are the seven? Because I just have five. Yeah, here. I'll uh, I'll I'll uh, make this a little bit bigger, but I'll read them all off uh, real quick. Um, full disclosure: there have been several hundred murders here. You can't stop laughing, even saying it out loud. You're laughing. <laughs> it comes with some strings attached. Clever, but I'm not laughing. It's yeah. very pet friendly. The also clever, not really laughing. The neighborhood. So let, let, let's kill. Let's kill. It comes with some strings attached. It's, it's just really a word joke. Well, well all right, hold it. Just. No, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's not as funny um, as pet friendly. I think pet friendly is funnier than than the strings. But what are you going to say, Lord? Oh, I okay. Well, I, I did not have strings attached in my top 10, but I think it's better than Pet Friendly. Pet Friendly just seems so obvious. It's a little on the nose. Yeah. Ooh, yeah to, a, they're lit. Lynn killing it with, ouch. with a comedy co <laughs> criticism on the nose. <laughs> you can't have on the nose. Ouch. Yeah. All right. That's a, um, all right. It's out. It's out. It got, it, it got bopped on the nose. It got it. it uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, um, all right, so we have. Uh, I, I I sadly hate to be so anticlimactic here, but it seems like we uh, we have the the winner. The seller is highly unmotivated. Unmotiv these are all, I, these are all, all, all good catch. Yeah, I, so I, I I'm gonna call it now, right? The seller well, is well, highly unmotivated. Is the winner? Yeah. Have, well, let's uh. Well, but before we look up the voting and and see some winners. Uh, Lynn's original caption was, yeah. it's open concept and practically new as the previous owner was declawed. Oh, that's quite good. It just reminded me though that there were two, uh, there were two uh, entries that both had really bad, the same bad pun, which was foreclosure. They both used foreclosure. Yeah, sure, yeah. Yes. And I, I did kind of take my hat off to them for, oh. for going for it. The person who said something about cat GTP made me want to bang my head in the desk. Uh, yeah, so that one was uh, such there, a groan uh, by myself alone. I groaned. Uh, there was there were some that, awful puns. Yeah, there was one that said like there was a furry of activity. A furry. I had to read it twice because at first I was like it was a flurry of activity, but no, it was a furry of activity at three a.m. or something. Oh my! Look at this. This is the. This is another first. The seller is highly unmotivated. Is the number one judge, number one in judging? Oh, no way, Lynn. I don't know if you know this, but we have never had any. We've never been in. Wait, well, so we, we, we have, we, we have people vote, but we we look at the votes after. How many so. votes were there? I mean, how many people vote for? Uh, it's a. Uh, oh, how many people total voted? I, we do have some sort of an al of an average. We have an average score algorithm for the voting. Well, can um, you sh share the screen? Unfortunately, it has uh, their emails, and we. Okay, we, that's last okay. time we shared, we got some uh, some people upset about. Oh it. yeah, no worries. Uh, <laughs> let me see if I can squeeze the uh, my window. Uh, we'll have to get tech to fix. Oh wait, yeah, it's working. Okay, I, I can share like this. Yeah, but we actually had uh, we had some people upset that their emails were public, which makes sense. We uh, we're not yeah. here to do that. Um, so the seller is highly unmotivated. Bad puns. <clears throat> the seller is highly unmotivated. You should pounce on this. I'd pounce yeah. if I were you. It comes with some strings attached. Oh, the mortgage is fixed too. Zing. Yeah. The sellers are completely ignoring me. I quite actually that was on my list. I quite like that one. The seller knocked our offer off the table. There are no offers on the table. He knocked them. Well, well, the people are they're allowed Lynn to submit three captions. So often they uh, they do versions. That's what oh, most likely okay. happened there. So yeah, uh, yeah that's it. where we are. We actually, um, we so, actually so so there was yeah. public. We're with the public today, uh, and I will read the winner. Um, I can. I'm just going to actually quickly check because it's such an obvious but great caption. I want to make sure no one else did it. Okay, Carol Lasky. Ooh. Oh, she's oh. a she's a frequent finalist All in right. the New Yorker contest. Congratulations to Carol! Right, uh, great that, caption. Let me. Uh, I'll share the. Uh, yeah, that's great. Final. Um, 
and I I think I'm right. Is she is she from Boston? Uh, we can give her a shout out to her business, uh, CahootsDesign.com, is uh, her email. I, I, I think I could be wrong about this, but I think her son is Colin Mills, who's also been a finalist in the New Yorker contest a couple times. Oh, a family affair. So yeah, there's a family connection. connection. Yeah. So thank you, Carol. Um, thank, thank you, thank you, Lynn, for joining us, and uh, yeah. and everybody. Great for working and uh, we'll, we'll have a sign off. Um, and, uh, and so, yeah, check out the next caption on Monday from Amy Kurzweil. All right. Brilliant.